there are a lot of requirements to qualify for things such as Act 60. A lot of people just want to come down here to save on property taxes. Property taxes has turned into almost another mortgage for the majority of Americans and the majority of the cities in the United States. And we have a gigantic growth of people that are retiring and wanting to relocate to Puerto Rico just so that they don't have to pay such high amounts of property tax on their on their property when they've already paid it off. We do pay CRIM, which is um, municipal taxes. This is based on the value of your home, but typically that's much lower. That value used is much lower than the real value of the property. And most people that have this as their primary residence have a tax incentive of about $15,000 a year. And after you deduct that, some people don't even pay any tax or what they pay is very little compared to the United States, making it very attractive and contributing a lot to the massive growth that the Puerto Rico market is having. Next slide. The tourism sector is expanding because we have so many opportunities for short-term rentals, investing in small little units that have sometimes even six, seven, eight units but they're not hotels, they're apartments. You can have that as a great investment 